Florida, 1,350 miles of temperamental shifting shoreline. This is an area where you can see geologic processes happening right before your eyes. Increased demand for coastal property. Erosion is never a problem until you put a line in the sand and say, this is where we're going to live. Predictions of more frequent devastating storms. Coastal climate change is real. Sea level rise is real. The natural flow of geological cycles. We are losing the beaches. We are just flat out losing them. These factors threaten to erode the foundation of a state built on the bounty of its land. There are a lot of stakeholders that have a vested interest in the future of our coastline. With so much already gained, a lot of money is tied up in those land resources. Will the risk of total loss be enough to save Florida's beaches? It's time that the state wakes up and takes a look at the Florida Beach Management Plan. Or will warning signs be ignored? Now that we have all this knowledge, why don't we use it? Until one of the last vestiges from our ancient past. What is good for sea turtles is also good for people and tourism. Is forever lost in our near future. If they don't have a place to nest, they may very well go extinct. 1,350 coastal miles, dozens of conflicting needs, only one place to go. When we destroy our coastal environment, we're destroying it for everyone, not just the creatures that live there. Higher Ground, the battle to save Florida's beaches.